tuned to this. Uh, we're going to do an easy climbing scale in E minor and hopefully A minor. I know sometimes I say A minor and then I actually forget to film. My bad. Okay, so you're in E minor. Uh, this is cool because um, there's certain portions of the neck where you can kind of, it's, it's good because they're, the, the frets are mirrored. Except for there. But then you're up. You can do that kind of a thing. So the way you can think about this is that you're in the key of E, but you're gonna start on the D note, which is a full step below. So there's your D note, there's your E note, and you're gonna go three, five, seven twice. But you're also gonna slide to eight on the high E. Uh, the cool thing about that is that you're uh, using alternate picking. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down. And that sets you up for the next set of six, which is going to be uh, five, seven, eight, twice. And then slide up to ten. Five, seven, eight, five, seven, eight, ten. Down, up, down, up, down, up, ten. And now we're here. So now we've got seven, eight, ten, twice, to twelve. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Whole thing, slow. And then we've got eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. So eight, ten, twelve, twice. Uh, and then slide up from here to here, 14. Whoops. And you have a, the big vibrato on this F sharp note. Slide up again and... Then you're in the E minor pentatonic. So, nice and slow, you've got... time slow I didn't mess up that ending I did that all on purpose so yeah You can take that shape, those shapes. And uh, let's find the octave. Let's find a D note. So we're just gonna take everything we just did and do an octave lower. So same shapes. We're using the A and D, fifth fret. And whatever else. But those are the shapes. Same exact shapes, different strings, different frets. Um, okay, now I said I'd show you an A. So if there's an A note, A flat, G. do the same exact thing you're basically just the, the fingerings are exactly the same just a different part of the neck so uh, the first batch on A is going to be uh, 8, 10, 12 to 13 10, 12, uh, 13 to 15 12, 13, 15, 17. 
And then you've got 13, 15, 17 to 19. Now you're here. Uh, you can do your... Um, I was going to show you something else, but I think I had forgot while I was doing that. I completely forgot what I was going to do. Oh, no, I wasn't. Um, ah, because A is in obviously a different spot on the neck, you can use all three uh, octaves in quite nicely. So, so with this, so now we're in the middle of the, we're using... D and G. There's the first one. Five, seven, nine to ten. Seven, nine, ten, seven, nine, ten, twelve. Um, what is that? Nine, ten, twelve, nine, ten, twelve, fourteen. And then you've got ten, twelve, fourteen, ten, twelve, fourteen, um, sixteen. And then you can. Uh, find the G note here. Same thing applies. Three, five, seven, three, five, seven, eight. Five, seven, eight, five, seven, eight, ten. Seven, eight, ten, seven, eight, ten, twelve. Eight, ten, twelve, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Slide up one. Do what you gotta to end how you gotta, but that's basically it. Learn something and once, and those those are the easy ones. There's other ones that are a bit fiddly where you have a mixture of uh, where you use all your four fingers in different ways, shapes and forms. I'm giving you the easiest ones. And uh, look, we'll talk later in the next video. I love you. I should probably stop now because I've been doing a lot of videos today. I'm not gonna fucking bother. All right, talk to you soon. Bye.